Good morning, Michael Dolce with Dolce Limited, distributors of the EFIN SUP motorizing kit. Now this unit has been returned. It was an Amazon purchase and the person said it's defective, it's not working. So I've pulled out the EFIN, I put it into a uh, 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 an adapter fin box so I can hold it up and I've pulled out the battery the instructions the remote <clears throat> and the charger all the things that came with the unit were returned uh, the first thing that I want to do is I want to plug in uh, the unit because I'm going to test that so tighten that up uh, I listen for a beep which would beep. The next thing I want to do is see if the remote is starting the unit. It's not, but it's not because the battery's dead. There should be a light that tells you uh, when you press this button that the battery's good. The battery's gone bad. It's accessible and replaceable. It's a $3 battery. That said, let me pull one out of the drawer. Okay, so I'm going to pair this battery um, let me make sure it works. You see the red light? So it tells me the battery's good in this unit. I'm going to pair this. What I have to do is I have to turn on the battery. And this is per the instructions. Press the square and the up arrow at the same time. Did you hear it beep twice? It tells me it's now connected to the battery and works. At this point, I can start the unit if this is good and nothing's defective. Folks, nothing's defective. So this unit that was a $3 battery was returned, and the customer has to pay the shipping. That's over $25. And there's in these instructions, it tells you to check things such as that. Let me cut off the, uh, the unit. So, But this was returned as a defective unit. This is not defective. This is a, a operator issue where somehow the battery's gone down either from use or just battery life and this should last six months three months depends on how much use it is but the efin is good the battery is good and i i checked this it's got plenty of charge um so bad remote that said i'm seeing some things on here that tell me this was not maintained properly. Can you see that? So there's a screw that holds a handle on both sides is rusted. So stainless rust in a saltwater environment, and this was in a saltwater environment, probably left outside. Um, yeah, I see some like salt on that connection. See if there's anything in there. I didn't check that. Yeah, I can see where there's kind of a salty atmosphere in here. So I could, I'm going to clean that out. But I'm going to contact the buyer. I will, I will replace or repair this. That's the warranty. But with Amazon, for 30 days, they'll let you return this for no fault. This is several months old. So uh, it's going to be sent back to the buyer. Uh, the buyer will be charged shipping. So he's got $50 in shipping. And my whole point, folks, is that you need to check anything electronic that uses a battery. In this case, it was simple. If he had noticed that this light wasn't lighting, it's a battery. That's kind of common sense. But anyway, this will be returned to Mr. R. And the EFIN motorizing kit is the best available. It is reliable. It's simple. And it'll power a paddleboard for a weak paddler, for fishing, or for touring. So if somebody's against a strong current, they aren't a strong paddler. This EFIN is a lifesaver. Thank you for watching. Again, Dulcie, 800-969-7473 for the EFIN. Thanks for watching.